Hey guys, before this video begins, if you enjoy all of my content, make sure to smash that subscribe button and to hit the bell next to the subscribe button to turn on notifications. It'd mean the world to me if you did it, and plus, then you can join the Rock Army. I'll see you guys in the video. What's that? What do you mean big changes are coming? You read the script? What script? You're freaking me out, Mr. Oinkers. Uh, look, I don't have time for this. I can't be late again. See you later. Ah, you're here early. Good. Got any more weird tests for me? Haha, <laughs> not just yet. But be careful, your wish might come true. Uh, okay. Uh, Professor Alfie? It's Alfred! Right, sorry. Um, Aaron is in one of the first year classes, and, uh, he, he won't get here in time. That's a shame. He will just have to hear today's lesson from you. Uh, what? Oh, yes. This class is of the utmost importance. Can I count on you to relay all the information to Aaron? His life may depend on it. His life? <laughs> I'm just pulling your leg. Do not call me Alfie ever again. Oh, okay. Take your seat. Y yeah. Poor Paul. Are you kidding? That was great! You're so mean. And you love me for it. <laughs> and who couldn't love that pretty meaty face? Uh, don't start, you two. Have no fear, your Dean is here. Dean Petra? What are you doing here? He has some important information for all of you. Indeed! I'm here to announce the beginning of the Academy Olympics. Well... Technically, the Olympics won't start until all the academies have chosen their delegates, but you get what I'm saying, right? It's just a matter of semantics. What it means to actually start, you see. Uh, maybe you'd like to get to the point, Dean. Ah, right. Of course. Well, a test much like an obstacle course will be held to determine which of you will represent our academy at the Olympics. An honor I'm sure you would all love to have. Much, I'm sure, like the honor and recognition I get as the Dean of this Academy. But with the rich history and past successes this Academy has been a part of, and... Ahem. <clears throat> but I digress. To keep it simple, your powers will be necessary to complete the obstacle course. And you will need to keep both your mind and your body in peak conditions. Be mindful of your abilities and those of your friends. And at the end of the test, we will reveal who will go to the Olympics in representation of this academy. There are five primary spots, with two substitutions. Good luck to you all. I'm sure you'll make all of us proud. Let's say goodbye to the Dean and carry on with our lesson. Goodbye, everybody. And with that, let's begin class. Air runes and why you should definitely avoid sneezing in public if you have them. A lesson I'm sure Brandon knows by heart. <laughs> Are you sure about this? I wouldn't have it any other way. Oh, you look so cute when you agree to fight me. Okay, so how do we start this? How about... Uh, oh, okay, I see. Ah, let's do this. Time to show you my newest trick. Whoa! Babe! Babe, are you okay? I'm so sorry, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Works every time. 
can someone get me the plate of the beautiful hunk of metal that ran me over? <laughs> stop that. Never stop. <laughs> that was amazing, babe. But you need to work on it. You could seriously hurt innocent bystanders. Yeah, that's why we came out here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Sorry about that, buddy. Help. <laughs> I need to get better at not getting hit. I'm done being just the healer, the weakling of the group. I'm my own person. Just a scratch. Oh well, practice makes perfect. Let's go again. Hey Jay. Hello Ryan, may I be of service? I'm looking for Petra. Good for you, but I asked if I could be of service, not what you are doing. I, uh, could you help me find Petra? Of course I could! Jay? Yes? You aren't doing anything. I know! I asked if you could find Petra for me! And I told you, I could! Ugh, I can't believe this is happening. Look, just help me find Petra. Sure, follow me! <laughs> I... <sighs> Thank you, Jay. You are most welcome. I'm always glad to help. Ryan, my boy, how are you? Shouldn't you be training? Oh, I know you're very powerful, but you shouldn't take this test lightly. Your classmates are all talented as well. Yeah, I know. I actually came here to talk to you about these Olympics. Okay. What do you want to talk about? My powers. Is it really safe for me to take part in the Olympics? Like, what if I lose control? I could hurt somebody. I don't want that on my conscience. I wouldn't want to hurt anybody just because I went berserk. It is completely normal for you to be worried about such things, Ryan. And as your dean, I can tell you, you're not alone on this subject. But I have seen what you're capable of. Not just raw destruction and power, I'm talking about how smart and quick your mind can be. If there's anyone out there that's able to harness the power of fire and find a way to control it, it's you. You can't be afraid of your powers. Sometimes you just have to grab the cow by the horns. Uh, shouldn't it be a bull? They both have horns, don't they? I don't see the difference. All right. Remember where you came from? You used to be unable to control your powers, but you've improved so much, and now I've heard some really good things from Alfie. He even said you managed to find a state that prevents you from blowing up completely. The point is, it's not only myself that thinks so, but I bet your friends believe in you too. The only person that hasn't seen it yet is you. Wow, thanks! Anytime. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm trying to find a way to modify Jay's behavior when offering help. He keeps playing with semantics. <laughs> yeah, I noticed as much. Thanks for the help. I thought I would see you here. How did you know? Everybody's training. So I thought I could lend a hand. I didn't expect you to get her so late, though. <laughs> Sorry, got a little sidetracked there for a sec. Don't worry about it. So, how's that controlling your power so you don't kill a bunch of people working out for you? It's pretty hit or miss, actually. But the meditation exercises you showed me, they've helped a lot. Thanks for that. It's nothing. Just don't tell anybody I taught you that myself. I don't want anyone thinking I'm playing favorites. Ah, uh, but I know you do. Yeah... It's Tori. Hey! What? She's really smart. If she had psychic power, she'd be able to bulldoze all of you without even trying. Alas, it wasn't meant to be. Well, are you gonna help me train or what? <laughs> Did I hurt your feelings? 
Don't worry, you may not be my favorite, but you're definitely in the top three. Well, maybe top four. <laughs> yeah, yeah, whatever. I feel a lot of worry. You need to put that at ease. You're doing all you can to get control. There you go. Inhale, then exhale. Remember, getting into the right state of mind is paramount to your success. Specifically if you want to control your powers. Yeah. You're in control. This fire is your fire. It only burns when you command it to burn. You're in control. You're in control. Yes, I have it. It's working. I... No. No. Focus. You need to breathe, Ryan. So you're tensing up. Did I... I almost lost it. I know, but it's okay. How is it okay? I've been studying what you've done in the simulation a couple days ago. You can only get into that fire state when you're close to going berserk. That sounds extremely dangerous. All the more reason to control it, don't you think? I guess you're right. I have an idea, but it's a little, um, unorthodox. Do you trust me? Yeah, I do. I'm going to access your mind. I'll see if I can use your memories to trick your body into responding. Try to remember you're only seeing memories. Maybe that way you can control it. Uh, okay. You shot Tori? How dare you! Oh, this isn't gonna be fun. I am I'm going, going to, to take, take you down. down! Back up, dork. It's going to get hot in here. Must not lose it! Channel your anger! You can do it! You That's it! You're doing it! You're... Oh, wait... Ryan? Ryan, what's happening? I did it, but I... Something is wrong. I'm not... Feeling stronger. M more like... Ryan! I... Ryan! I... What happened? You passed out of dehydration. I... I did? That's what happens when you go around using fire and don't drink any water at all. Here. Thanks. I guess you're right. That was so weird. One second, I was training, and the next second, everything started spinning and it was lights out for me. You need to take better care of yourself. Come on, the nurse said you could leave after you woke up. Okay. Hey, what's that? Uh, just a little training accident. It's nothing, really. You should be more careful. <laughs> You're one to talk. At least I'm not passing out from exhaustion because of my training. Guess you got me there. What were you doing anyway? I, uh, was trying to control my berserk state. <gasps> Brian, that's too dangerous. I know, I know. I only do it to avoid hurting you guys. You should ask us for help. We could, I don't know, figure something out. Yeah, look, there's some things I just have to figure out on my own. Oh, sure, I get it. I should probably get some rest. You're right, anyway, I should probably go. Bye. Bye.